Marvel's What If, a series that follows the Watcher as he explains what could have happened in the Marvel Universe if someone had made a different decision, whether be it small or big. So obligatory spoiler warning. <laughs> In episode 1, we get a universe where instead of Steve Rogers getting baked in the superhero steroid oven, it was Peggy Carter. And let it be known that one of the major reasons I got into physics was because I watched a mini documentary about multiverse theory at the age of 7. And 14 measly years later, one of my major dreams of becoming a physicist has happened and I got my degree. But enough about me, what if Captain America was Captain Carter? And man, it was a joy to watch. I mean, story-wise it followed enough of the beats of Captain America to not feel alien but have the challenges that would face Miss Carter as a woman of the time and I was so happy when they didn't make Steve Rogers bitter that Peggy got the roids instead of him but rather he became supportive of her and because of that he got a way to help her in the war all these tiny things I, I was really scared yeah but we also get a lot of like Tony's dad and it feels like a 40s versions of Tony with all the swagger and the weird sayings like the cat's pajamas oh no 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 you continue just pretend I'm not here I don't think he says that but I think he should have said it. Cat's pajamas. Let's go. The visuals were great too. I mean, 3D in tune shading and 2D for the effects blended beautifully together. I rewatched it many times to get re inspired by the environment and the excellent animation. Right now, I'm sitting here waiting in eager anticipation. Patient. As I was jo I was watching it, I was enjoying all the beats and then when she got her version of the suit and the shield, I was like, wait, so is she going to call herself Miss Britain or the Queen of England? And then she said Agent Carter and I'm like, yeah, I guess it makes sense. She's not presumptuous to take the Queen's place, but she is proud enough to go by her name. But those were my opinions. What do you think of episode one if you've seen it? Do you know any other interesting facts about this thing? I like facts. Tell me in the comments or send smoke signals. I'm always looking out my window for some reason and that's it for me see ya when i get more inspiration juice from episode two ta so long,